All right, I don't know if you guys can hear that. There's a bit of a noise coming. This is part of a septic system. So up here in the woods, you have a big septic bed with tiles. This is where all your sewage goes to get filtered. And there's some mechanical parts of it. This one makes a little bit of a sound. It's sort of annoying. So I have been building an enclosure. And the camera kind of crapped out on me earlier, so I didn't get the this first part I thought it was recording but it wasn't so it's very simple two by four frame I've done it all with uh, I think seven pressure treated two by fours and the whole idea is that this thing can be just lifted off if anybody needs to uh, work on this piece of machinery and what I'm gonna do here is plywood pressure treated plywood on the lower half and a bit on the roof here but I'm going to leave this section open all the way around for some air circulation and then I'm going to put some um, hard uh, pink fiberglass not fiberglass foam insulation in these cavities here just to try and deaden the sound a little bit and then I've got a, a few pieces of uh, old roof shingle uh, I'm just going to tack on there, just keep the water off and hopefully deaden some sound. So uh, I'll show you more of this as we go. Cutting it with a pruning saw. All right, so we're just about done here. Simple box. See inside, I've got this half inch foam, R30 insulation, hopefully just to deaden the sound. Got some half inch pressure treated plywood along the outside. I kind of overdid the screws uh, around the edge, thinking that if somebody ever needs to work on this, the tradesman can just pick up the whole box. It's not anchored to the ground in any way and it won't come apart. And then I think I'm gonna put, I'm gonna wedge a couple pieces of foam right here in between these two bays here before I sheet it. And I've got some old leftover uh, roof and shingles. I'll just tack some on the top. But the idea is then again to leave this open here all the way through and around here so that this machine can ventilate a little bit. All right, so just put a bit of a roof on there. Now, 
you don't have to comment on what a crap job that was. There's no tar paper. I didn't nail in the right patterns. But basically, this is just to make it disappear, give it a little bit of protection from the elements. It's not meant to be waterproof or anything, but it just looks a lot nicer. And then once this dries out a little bit, I'll throw some dark green stain on it and will disappear, hopefully. And hopefully from a distance, it blocks the sound. All right.